Hello! So, there's gonna be a fate channel, I think. There should be. Or you're probably gonna have a bunch of angry players coming outside of IS's headquarters, demanding the CYL5 results, knowing where Brave, Keep Brave Gatekeeper is. Like, down with Marth, down with Crom, where's Gatekeeper? Sorry, my brother's just being stupid. He came into the room. Anyways, there was about to be a Fey channel, most likely. And probably accompanying it, the seasonal trailer, because I thought there was one on the fourth. It's unlikely it'll be Shadows of Valentia, but who knows? We could get a second Valentia in Valentine's. I think a lot of people are saying it's Three Houses and probably some other game. Probably Talius. As you know, I just love to get the popular crap in. Okay, and hopefully this will be my first successful Fade Channel reaction. I mean, filmed, that is. Anyway, see why all five results are revealed. I want to see one, make sure Gatekeeper isn't in the top two for men's, and two, want to know where a certain somebody places it's 10 o'clock. Okay, let's do this. Huh. That's weird. Okay. Hmm. Thinking like me, man. Hmm. It's 10. Yeah, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Hmm. Hmm. Unless it's not tonight. Oh, this is very risky, but I'm checking Discord. Okay, hey. I just covered everything with my hand. Unless they just released the CYL results. Hmm. Oh god. Do they just release everything? Like, regarding CYL? I'm gonna keep refreshing. This is also kind of risky. Just going on Google on my phone. Hmm. I'm not seeing anything.
Maybe give it another minute or two. This is IS we're talking about. They're pretty inconsistent sometimes, of course. I mean, you know, we don't really find certain things out. Okay. I'm giving it about another minute. I swear I have it on videos. I mean, oh, there's a fair channel. Hold on. Oh, thank you. Well, this is going to be a long ass video. Flap, 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 flap. Flap, 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 flap. Flap, flap. Say, hello, summoners. Hey, it's so chilly these days that I've been having trouble leaving my warm, downy bed in the morning. But I'd never leave you out in the cold. That's why I, Faye, have braved the harsh, wintry conditions to gather some exciting news to share with all you summoners. Get ready for a cozy helping of info on the Fire Emblem Heroes game to keep you warm. It's time for Faye Channel. Let's get started. I'll be gonna place above crown at least. There's a flurry of things to share this time around. Let's start here. All right, Faye, what do you want? What do you want, sweetheart? Oh yeah! Oh boy! It's time to announce the results of the Choose Your Legends Round Five event. Thanks to all you summoners out there who took the time to vote. Gatekeeper is second or something. Or no, he knocked Marth out of first, as usual. The heroes this year, as chosen by you, are these fine folks. Oh, what the hell? Versions of these four heroes are planned to be added to the game later this summer. Oh, I can't wait to see are how they look. Are you serious? Gatekeeper. Next up, we'll be holding a series of events to celebrate the fourth anniversary of the Fire Emblem Heroes game. Thanks to the support of all you summoners. We've been able to keep things going for four whole years! As with previous anniversaries, we've got a whole lot going on to celebrate right. our fourth. And it all begins February 1st. Let's dig in and see what's coming, shall we? Whatever. First up is the fourth anniversary login bonus. This time around, the anniversary bonus takes the form of two different login bonuses that will be live at the same time. You can earn two orbs each day for a total of up to 20 orbs from Login Bonus 1 and up to 44 Trait Fruit from Login Bonus 2. Don't forget to log in each day to collect it all. I don't want to make Next a smoothie are some out of fourth anniversary the and Aether fruit. Raids quests. If you clear these quests while they're active, you can earn the rewards shown here. That's a lot of fours. Oh, it looks like there's something else as well. A lot of death. China. Fei, Fei. I saw, I saw. What could this be? I saw it's the form of gold. Oh, I can't believe my feathers! This time, as a special reward, you can earn a Forma Soul. A Forma Soul is an oh, yeah, 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 yeah. To add one of the Forma units you train up in Hall of Forms to your army. I wish I could get one for If you Ellen. haven't used a Forma Soul before, be sure to take advantage of this opportunity and use it during the next Hall of Forms event. It's hard to pick which Forma to add to your army, I isn't it? Get one of the I really Next like up, it's the 4th Anniversary Tempest Trials Plus event and quest All rewards! Right. Who will the special heroes be? In continuing the 4th Anniversary celebration, you can pick up some pretty exciting rewards, as shown here. There are a whole lot of rewards available, so be sure to join in the celebration. Not playing heroes right now. Faye. Was that... a ticket? Oh my! 
It looks like there's going to be a new Hero Fest. And the Hero Fest that's available when you first start Aren't playing you the game what a will be changed return. to this version. Also, it looks like 10 of the tickets I showed you earlier as part of the Tempest Trials Plus Awards can be used on the new Hero Fest. Moving right along, we're hosting another Grand Hero Party. What's that? Seven of the Grand oh. Hero Battles from Holy 2020 Gangrel. are back Her as Grand happy. Hero oh, Battle God. Revivals. They'll be available okay. for two days each for that a total just... of 14 days. There are some Holy. quests that allow you to add these grand heroes to your barracks. Yeah. So even if you manage to take them down the first time around, you should definitely give them another go. Next, we have the Special Hero Summon Year 4 event. All right. Of all the special heroes released in events running between February 1st, 2020 and February 1st, 2021, you can summon one into your barracks for free. Hmm... Picking a color is never easy. <laughs> the hero you can summon is determined by the color of the summoning stones available to you. So think hard about which color you want to summon on. Don't even gonna do this one. Next up, it's information on the A Hero Rises 2021 event. Just like in previous years, Not doing your it. votes will determine the top hero among those who have appeared in Fire Emblem Heroes since launch. We set up a special website where you can go to vote. Not until you guys add loot today. here. Please go vote if you can. After voting on the website has ended, the top eight heroes from A Hero Rises 2021, as selected by you, More will go head-to-head -head in an in-game voting gauntlet. The hero that comes out on top in the voting gauntlet will be gifted to all you summoners. We've also got a little something special planned. The top four heroes in the voting gauntlet will be featured in a summoning event. What about Tempest Trials? What's more, if you summon a total of 40 or more times on the event, you'll be able to summon one of these heroes for free. That means that even the heroes who don't quite make it to the top spot have a chance of making their way into your barracks. Well, that's nice. As a treat for myself, I baked a cake to celebrate the fourth anniversary. I remember the second I anniversary think I'll save cake. I will it for later when I can share a slice with the chief. The chief All right, is. Then, here's what's next. Is it Garrick? Oh boy. Ta-da! This I year, heroes from the Fire Emblem Heroes game are participating in the Day of Devotion festivities. Is there a bell's gonna it get on? Looks it like off? some familiar faces from both Asker and Embla are here to celebrate. I think I saw Let's here. take a look together. I hope Mirabella's get something. Okay. I must protect my people, even if it costs me my life. Alphonse and Sharina's daddy. First up, it's Gustav. It looks like a Greek He's god. He's the king of Asker. And that makes him Alphonse and Sharena's father. He put his son Alphonse first in the war with Hell, the realm of the dead, as I recall. Know the I always thought Asker. Gustav was strict and a little scary. But in that moment, I could really feel the deep and loving bond that he shared with his son. Please let Mirabella's get an alt. Oh, nice. I'm Alphonse and Sharena's mother. Please, call me Henriette. Hello. Thought you looked like Edelgard, Next, honestly. We have Henriette. She's the queen of yeah, Asker, rather, and Edelgard looked like you. You guessed it. Alphonse and Sharena's a mother. She always no has such a cheery disposition. <laughs> it looks like she's really enjoying the festival. She must be really strong. I guess it's yeah, pretty obvious where Sharena's personality comes from, isn't it? Yeah. It did. yeah. This oh, festival really? brought my mother and father together. Oh, Sharena. Nothing could make me happier. Gonna be a duo lead. Following the family ties, here's Alphonse. He's what the, the heck is this? They know. Member of the wow. Order of Heroes. Those are some legs. But I'm sure you already knew all that. Happy she looks so happy to be oh, able to really? participate in the festival. Oh really? Oh no! Three people. Uh, I don't know. You know, Alphonse is always fighting Bull to protect fighter. his people. Understand I think he's now? well on his way to being a great king someday. Oh, the people really? I'd like to give gifts to are Bruno and Xander. Oh, but of course, Xander. Moving on to another royal what family. Veronica's obsession it's with Xander. Veronica, princess like of the Faye. Emblian Empire. 
It's strange to say, but she actually looks like she's in a pretty good mood. Clover? Who wouldn't be with all those flowers around? I see Clover. Maybe she's joining in the festivities to learn oh, what never love mind. is all it's about. Like Whatever her goal may be, <laughs> it looks like Some she has presents for her brother Bruno. And Sander. Oh, lucky girl. Aww. Faye's got a crush. <laughs> anyway. Oh, actually, they could both be free. The day of devotion. Oh, really? A day to express gratitude to those important to you. This festival is not meant for us. We should go. I knew I saw Thrace here somewhere. Oh, wow! Can you believe not it? Not expecting these two. Last, but certainly not least, we have Leaf and Thracier. Looks they like Alphonse and Warren are going to be free heroes, heroes back in Book Three. But now, they're here as a duo hero. A gift. They're for also me? wearing brightly colored clothes for the Day of Devotion Almost Festival, summoning a which is quite them. a departure from their this usual dark and duty. brooding look. Not even playing in general. Uh, and just who could those flowers be for? They do look very nice. Gustav, Henriette, Alphonse, and the duo hero Leaf. Sorry, Alphonse. Will make an appearance in the upcoming special oh, heroes. Oh, the free gold fighter. Veronica will also join oh, your barracks nice. if you earn enough points in the Associated Tempest Trials she, Plus she event. That's really cute. She's oh, creepy. that's right! Adulty Remember vibes. those tickets I mentioned? Well, you can also earn five first summon tickets for this summoning event by playing Tempest Trials Plus. Hey! I get all fuzzy inside seeing their happy faces. Isn't the Day of Devotion just the best? That's nice. <gasps> Moving right along, we've got this. Yes. It's information do, on the next do, do, version do, update. Do, 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 Starting with the next version update, oh God. the maximum hero merit a hero can earn will increase from 6,000 to 7,000. That means you'll be able to receive hero feathers from your heroes two more times, even if they previously reached their hero merit limit. Nice. Thank you. Next up is... Yes. Faye? Oh! What are you doing here? Is something wrong? Wait, what? Faye, Faye. I saw boobs! Oh, wow. Whoa. Whoa! Look at you! Oh, God. With the next version update, summoners will be able to customize... themselves! You can set things up on this screen. In the bully? My Summoner menu, you'll be able to set your name, your greeting when you visit a friend's castle, and more. You can change your summoner's oh, appearance so here. I swear we're <laughs> There are even People some accessories that can only be worn by summoners, so be sure to check them out and try some on. Hmm. Not only can you change your appearance, but summoners will soon be able to join the battle against Thor's advancing army in Mjolnir's strike. Hmm. Cool. Fei Fei, check this summoner out. Well, now who I'm hearing Luffy or whatever. to fight? Ah, I'm so impressed by their skills on the battlefield. Fei Fei, this summoner's overcome all kinds of obstacles and grown Maybe stronger. This way. I didn't know you had it in you. <laughs> Fei. What's that? This isn't the Mjolnir strike you're familiar with? I'm so one. glad you noticed. I don't have much more on that now, but not to worry. We'll explain in detail at a later date via an in-game notification. Hmm. Oh, weird. Oh, that's right. That summoner seemed to have some really powerful skills, didn't they? Yep. How do you think they learned them? Manuals. With their special copy skills power, of really? course. Copy skills allows you to choose skills that your ally heroes have, copy them, and equip them right to yourself. Oh, Fair. wow. That seems interesting. I'm really looking forward to seeing all you summoners contributing to the cause directly in Mjolnir Strike from here on out. Finally, we have... What are you? Alternative mode. Ta-da! This just in. We're introducing a new type of summoning event and more changes to how summoning works. 
let's go over some changes to legendary heroes that have appeared in the game up until now, as well as Legendary Hero Remix. Mm -hmm. If you didn't guess, Legendary Hero Remix is a new type of summoning event. Mm -hmm. Some of the legendary heroes that previously appeared in Legendary Hero Summoning Events will now begin appearing in Legendary Hero Remix Summoning Events instead. These legendary heroes will be appearing in Legendary Hero Remixes from now on. Not only are they appearing in a new type of summoning event, but I hear some of them will be able to learn additional skills. To start things off, mm -hmm. legendary heroes Ike and Fjorm will mm -hmm. be learning additional skills. Okay. Even better, they won't be losing any of their current skills in exchange for these ones. Thank you They'll for have replay the guides. To learn them in addition to the skills they already have. Thank you. Ike will be getting Radiant Aether 2 and Joint Drive Resistance. That means he'll be able to increase his and his There's allies' no resistance. And it'll be easier for him to use his special as well. Fjorm and will be getting Ice Mirror guide. 2 and Attack Defense Unity. Oh, wow. She'll be able to reduce damage while dishing out even more steady damage than before. She'll be even stronger when she fights with allies at her side. There will be six other legendary heroes joining Fjorm and Ike in this new summoning event. And they and are? the appearance rate for five-star focus heroes will be set at 6%. With two heroes available for each summoning stone color, oh. equaling a total of eight heroes with an appearance rate of 6%, It'll be a little easier than ever to add a legendary hero to your barracks. Plus, it looks like you'll be able to choose one hero to summon for free in this event after 40 summons. It's your chance to summon and aim for one of these legendary heroes. Legendary Sorry, but I'm hero declining. Remix starts February 11th. I hope you're looking forward to it. Next up, I'll cover changes to the way summoning works. Alternative mode. Alternative mode. Alternative mode. Okay. Alternative mode. Four star special raid. What could this be about? Hmm? A summoning screen. I guess there's only one thing to do. Tap. Oh god. Oh god, the red one. Why the red one? Oh god, no. God, no, please no. I thought I'd summoned a four-star hero, but they turned into a five-star hero instead. And I think I'm starting to understand how this works. This occurrence is based on your four-star special rate. Plus, when you summon a four-star hero who becomes a five-star hero on the screen, the five-star hero Wait. appearance rate that you've built up with summons won't be reduced. The heroes that are available to be summoned this Wait. way are the five-star new heroes that appeared in the game up until August of 2018, shown Wait. here. What? I bet you're used to seeing them in summoning event revivals, huh? Oh no. Is this From now on, these heroes will no longer appear in summoning events at five-star rarity. The four-star special rate will be available on summoning oh! events that begin on or after February 4th. Faye! It'll even be applied to the fourth anniversary Wait. hero fest whoa, whoa, whoa. I introduced earlier. Are you saying they're gonna be four star focus? No way. A four star special rate and a fourth anniversary. How exciting! Thank you. We've been waiting for the demo. Hey, Where's Altena? That's all I have the energy for today. But before I go, I just want to take this opportunity to thank all you summoners out there. It's due to your support that the Fire Emblem Heroes game has made it all the way to its fourth anniversary. I'll keep doing what I can to make sure things stay fresh, exciting, and fun for you. And I humbly request your continued support as we enter the game's fifth year. Oh, I almost forgot. We received some fantastic illustrations to commemorate the fourth anniversary from some of the artists who work on Fire Emblem Heroes. Be sure to stick around to check them out. All right. Now, as for me, give me the art, Faye. <sighs> Before I cook you like those red mages. Forever, <sighs> Faye.
cleavage. Oh, nice. Aww. Now that is cute. Darn. <laughs> Female Rima, no. Of course. Oh, I mean, I mean, oh, it does the sword hand. Essential. Say cheese, Hana. Click. She wanted it. Oh boy. Shannon and his man boobs. And Seth's having his man boobs too. Oh, Lacey Thea's enjoying some sweets. There's Shannon and Claude. Oh boy, some Plagian heroes. Plagian grills. Playable Thor when? Way to eat, babe. Just mean to hell and back. Zaki Uski. Do TCG? Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Let me let me see if there is a special heroes. Okay, I guess not. So yeah, it looks like that's the fair channel. Anyways. Guess I'll check the CYL5 results when possible. Although I'm not happy about Gatekeeper winning. Anyways, well, guess I'm done. So, bye.